Hey, this is Richie Dotson with Acoustic Box in Chesterfield County, Virginia. I'm often asked to install electric pickups in mandolins, and they all, well, this particular one at least comes with this attachment that you can attach to the side of the mandolin. Uh, it's not very stable, so I'm going to show you how I run it through uh, the, uh, the tailpiece. I've already drilled this. Didn't have a hole at all. Just a screw in there. So I've drilled it out and then reamed it with uh, with this magic reamer. So that means this now fits perfectly where it belongs. Now the tailpiece itself works really well with the end of this. So I don't have to do any modification of that. But what I do have to do is get it in there. And I can't get my hands in there. and certainly not going to be able to fish it uh, through in a way that uh, makes sense to some folks. So, um, even though Stuart McDonald makes a wonderful retriever for these, works great on guitar, won't work on a mandolin though. So what I do is I take a 90 thousandths piece of binding that will, uh, will squeeze in here fairly tight but can be removed get the other end seems a little better yeah that'll work so I start off with this this is actually a measuring device this hooks on the inside of the tail block and those little marks let me know how far to adjust this this needs to be uh, sticking out about yay far so you don't want this piece sticking out because this is all you need and it will work with the uh, work with the tail piece now I'm gonna fish this piece of binding through and let's see what happens let's get that out this end now it would probably be easier to try to fish this in this way but not at that awkward angle. So I tried to go here if it'll fit, and I, I think this one will. So that's installed. The washer's on there. Everything's set. You like to go straight down at this particular place. You just got to work with it a little bit. I'm going to tear the customer's mandolin up, and there it is. Now, you got to be gentle because you don't want to. Ah, there we go. The washer and the nut can be fed right onto the end of this. Oh, forgive me. Come out with that. I want to put the tailpiece on first. Then the washer. Slid right on there. Forgive the, the poor camera work. <laughs> totally my fault. We'll put the retaining screws on here afterward, but this gets you a good chunk of the way there. When you get it reasonably finger tight, you don't want to twist things around. Pull that binding out. Now Got a little hole in the side here that you can put your pin through. This little thin wrench, this one's a uh, half inch that we need on this one. And that is installed. Hope this helps some of you. Thanks.